I'm in the woods. Shh. The woods make me incredibly excited. I love being in the woods. enough of that silliness on with the video welcome back to my channel thank you very much for returning or if you're new join the crew did i just say that oh dear my channel is made up of me doing walks adventures mainly based in kent which is where i live and just exploring this beautiful land that some people call the british isles i call it that too so yeah makes complete sense today i am bringing you a video that i've been making over the last month and it is my challenge to myself to try and walk 10,000 steps every day for a month. I might be a little bit late to the party here. I know people have been doing these step challenges for ages and ages, but it suddenly occurred to me the other month or week, um, whenever it was, that I have never really tried to track or see how many steps I'm taking every day. I do a lot of walking, I have a walking group, I do research walks for my walking group, so I'm always out walking, but there are days when I work and I don't really move that much at all. I go down to the shops, go to the library, that is about it. So I was really intrigued to see whether I could walk 10,000 steps every day for a month. Before I show you some highlights, I want you to know that at the end of the video, you've got to stick around because at the end of the video, I'm going to show you exactly how many steps I averaged out on a daily basis over the month. Does that make sense? It does in my head. <laughs> stick around to see that breakdown. It's quite interesting to see and it's basically the whole point of this video. So you've got to watch to the end. Here are the highlights of my 10,000 step challenge. Good morning everybody, pinch and a punch for the first of the month, it's 1st of February today and I've started my goal to try and walk 10,000 steps for every day of February um, and I'm rocking the just got out of bed look because I have just got out of bed and the sun is shining, I've walked a thousand steps already so it's looking, looking quite achievable for today. going for a walk in the park to get my steps in and I'm up at about 6,000 at the moment. Can you hear that woodpecker? Got an 11 mile walk today, it's starting to rain. So 11 miles, I think, is about 25,000 steps. So I'm definitely gonna do my 10,000 steps today. Um, and then tomorrow I've got a six mile walk as well. So today and tomorrow are covered the steps, but it's just interesting to see how many more steps I'll do. Big show off. Three miles into the 11 mile walk, as you can see. A group are there walking across this lovely field and it's a lovely day it was raining earlier but now it's stopped so i keep going with the lovely walk lovely lovely <laughs> Whoa. morning everybody I don't know if anyone else out there is like me but I have a 10 minute walk to work this morning and normally what I do is run the whole way because I leave the house too late so I'm walking running to work through the back alleyways of Whitstable this morning and yesterday I really struggled to walk 10,000 steps um, I think I'm realizing that it is quite time consuming and when I have a walk at the weekend is very easy because I've dedicated that time to do some walking and uh, when I'm working it's going to be quite hard to fit in the 10,000 steps so we'll see how today and the next few days go. That is a poor attempt at snow. Did you enjoy those highlights? Well, here are some more. No, I'm joking, there's no more highlights, don't worry. <laughs> 
See the panic in your face, don't you worry. So 10,000 steps a day roughly is about five to six miles. So it's not a great distance, but if you're not walking or the weather's bad or you're not feeling great or whatever other excuses we all have for not walking, getting out and walking, then it is quite a distance. And also what I found was that it was quite time consuming. Like when I go out with my walking group and we do a walk, like that day is dedicated to walking and that's fine. A, it was quite time consuming. B, it, I felt like I was checking my app quite a lot, which was a bit frustrating. I didn't always want to be bringing my phone out with me, which you have to, because that is how you log the 10,000 steps. And C, I'm sure there's a C somehow. There's no C, there's no C. Sorry about that, there's just no C. Here is the overall amount of steps that I walked in the whole of February, averaged out over each day. So did I walk 10,000 steps a day? Let's have a look. There you go, I did, I was successful, woohoo! But there were some days, and there was one day in particular that I, I mustn't have walked more than about, excuse me, <laughs> I'm choking just thinking of that day, 2,000 steps or something like that, which is not a great distance at all, and it's not being very active. And the whole point of this challenge, I'm guessing, is to try and be as active as possible every single day. That is my review of the 10,000 step challenge. I uh, hope it motivates you to try your own challenge. Thank you very much for joining me. Please leave a comment below if you've done a 10,000 step challenge or if you're thinking about doing it, if you've got any questions or if you just wanna say hi. Bye for now and see you again very soon.